financial statement analysis reading between the lines. We're going to discuss learning objective two, which is to explain the concept of earnings management and its role in financial statement manipulation schemes. By design, GAAP sanctions a wide range of both operational and reporting freedoms, which are managerial judgments in the financial statements. Operational freedom involves making operational choices at year end to enhance the appearance of certain accounts, whereas reporting freedom involves the use of judgment in determining the amounts reported. Under GAAP, these freedoms are at least theoretically held in check by the principle of conservatism, which directs management to select methods and establish an estimate that avoid overstating assets, revenue, and income. We have seen repeatedly over the last decades um, some reporting flexibility provides opportunities that when coupled with the right motivation can result in earnings management. Earnings management, as defined by Schiffner in 1989, is the purposeful in intervention in the external financial reporting process with the intent of obtaining some private gain. In practice, earnings management encompasses a wide variety of legitimate and illegitimate actions by management that can impact reported earnings. Legitimate earnings management includes reasonable and proper practices that are part of operating a well-managed business and delivering value to shareholders. On the other side, illegitimate earnings management is inter intervening to hide real operating performance by creating an artificial entries or stretching estimates beyond a point of reasonableness. So academic research highlights the agency problem as a root cause of earnings management. The agency problem arises when a company's management is separate from its owners, and the owners are known as the principals, delegate decision-making authority to managers, which are the agents. Because principals and agents have different objectives, this situation creates the potential for a conflict of interest. And here we see our earnings management decision grid. So aggressive and fraudulent earnings management involves either one of three basic schemes. You're either going to overstate revenues, you're gonna understate expenses, and you're overstating the financial condition or liquidity of the company. And this concludes our video lecture for this learning objective.